So what I have here today are two models from 2016. Um, one is a new model, which is this one, and one is a model that doesn't have a whole lot of casting history, but I think it's also known as Skate Punk. This is called the Skate Brigade from the HW Daredevil series. It's 2 of 10 from that series, and it's 162 out of 250 overall. Um, here's the card art. Um, I believe um, this is Steve Cabello. I don't know anything about them, so don't don't ask. Um, I couldn't really read the signature, so when I looked it up in Google, um, it just went to someone's Facebook page. Anyways, um, here's the card art. Here's the back. Okay, I had this for a while, and I just never got around to reviewing it. Um, mainly because I didn't have it in plain sight. I had it kind of hidden someplace, so I never really... Uh, paid attention to anything. whatever. Um, so here it is. It says Caballero on the board and it has a dragon on there. Little plastic figure, and this does pop off. Um, I do have a skate punk to compare it with. As you can see, it does say skate punk right here. On Hot Wheels Wikipedia, they had two pages, one for Skate Punk and one for this one, and I don't think there were any uh, casting information on these. Sometimes that site's not as reliable. A lot of times I get a new car and it doesn't even have the information, because I usually uh, post pictures of this stuff on Facebook. Um, the page I have is United States Collecting, and I try to copy and paste the stuff, the little information on the back of the cards, but, you know, a lot of times they don't have it on there right away, so I end up not posting. Anyways, um, that's this one, and here's the other one. This one I keep in a little plastic bag, mainly because I don't want to lose the skateboard figure. The poses are a little different, and as you can see, the boards are really different. They're pretty much, I guess, identical. Yeah, usually when Hot Wheels they make another casting or another uh, variation, they don't change something like this, or not that I know of, because look how much different it is compared to this one. A lot of difference. Um, let's see, which one was it now? Okay, this is the one that we're looking at. Now. What's the other one? So we'll move on to the next one. Um, this one I already did. It's from a BMW five. It's five of five. It's a nineteen. It's nineteen. Uh, it's 190 out of 250. It's the 73 BMW 3.0 CSL race car. Now, I already did this, but that was in the previous color, so I thought I'd put it in this video because I, because I didn't want to do a whole lot. And here's the back of the card. I won't read this. Um, I'm not sure if I'll link anything to this video, but um, like I said, I did this card before, just with the other color. Okay, so here it is. I gotta look at it, and then I'll bring out the other one. Um, this casting, I wasn't sure if I was gonna buy, um, mainly because sometimes I don't buy every single copy of it or release. Um, but it only depends on what it looks like, and I thought it looked real cool in black. So the other version was in white. With the same the same uh, tampo design. Oh, but this one says 68 instead of 16, and it still says uh, Castrol. Different uh, windshields, as you can see, the uh, lights I think are attached to the windshield. So I guess if you wanted to add lights to it, you could. As you can see, it's blue on here. Um, nothing good in the interior. This one looks black, and this one's like a, a gray. All in all, they're pretty decent castings. Um, that's about it. Um, get another whirl on this one. And uh, that's it. You can like, share, comment, subscribe, or and have a nice day.